Something to really pick this place clean. VTO aircraft, titanium building units, and probably a land vehicle. What about that other bay? It doesn't look like they got there. We're not sure. No individual bay manifest. Great. Did you manage to get that open yet? Yeah, a couple more inches, maybe. Not one piece of probe info showed even an inkling of civilization. No roads, no structures, no agriculture. Whatever it is, it must be interested in manufactured goods. We've checked the last 25 years' worth of probe reports. There's nothing about flora and fauna. Yeah, government probes for newscast. We saw what they wanted us to see. One, two, three. Come on. Got him. All right. Yeah. Looks like we got ourselves a zero unit. Part of one, anyway. Actually, I've got an entire body in here. Construction worker series. Ready to give New Pacifica a full 100%. Uh, can't speak for New Pacifica, but we could sure use the rest of your unit. Easy there, pal. Oh, boy. it has got to be a smarter way to do this. Hold on! Hey, be careful. I will. Are you in? Yeah. Do you see the unit? Yeah, I see it. Okay, see if you can reach the collar control panel. All right. Be careful. I will. Whoa! It's humming. Give me a hand. What can I do? <laughs> Come here, I'll show you. Ready? All right. OK? Recon rail's your top priority, friend. Yeah, I thought everybody should be mobile. That's a good idea. All righty. Well, she's not much to look at, but a boy's got to have wheels, right? Hey, what did you think? I was going to carry you around everywhere? No, no, no. This will be fine. OK. This here's the brake. That makes you stop. Press this. That makes you go. This is where you steer. I had a point. You steer it like that. If you have any trouble getting it started, just jiggle that a little bit and spit on it. All right? All right. Let's give it a shot. All right. Take it easy, man. OK. All right, that's good. That's good. Just, just take your time. You're doing good. Just take your time. All right. Atta boy. Go, go, go. Atta boy. Don't forget to steer. It's all gone, Yale. Everything. Not everything, Devon. Most of our vehicles, communications equipment. Something's out there, Yale, and it's cleaned us out. We were perhaps foolish to believe there was no intelligent life here. I know. I just don't know what to do now. People are injured. O'Neill wants to follow those tracks, hunt down whatever creature stole our cargo. That might be imprudent, Devon. Tons of supplies and equipment, Devon, and it's nothing more than shiny beads and trinkets to some stunted tritoed hominids. I don't mean to second guess you, Broderick, but I don't think. Then this... don't. It's ours, Devon, and we have every right to go out and hunt it down. Drew, you ready to roll? Yeah. Careful. Uh. 
Okay, Yuli. Keep breathing. And? Give us your best shot. Not bad. Good job, Yuli. Good peek. My personal best? Almost. Well, let me see you drive this thing, okay? Why don't you go down to that tree and back? Tiny! <laughs> okay, be careful. Well, he's no worse, considering all he's been through. It's not a miracle, but it's something. All I want is to give him a chance. Nothing today suggests you can't. <sighs> Nothing for miles. No movement? Nothing. These tracks scattered in ten different directions. You won't be bested by this. Hey, hey maybe we ought to hold off a little. If I wanted to hold off, I'd stay on the station. Commander, we don't know what we're dealing with. Well, I know I fired my rifle, don't I? Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. <sighs> Just stay <laughs> like a That little bird's got it. has Hey. Protect them from evil. Amen. Children, I am sorry to have frightened you. Don't, Don't scare me. me. 
You want to talk about what happened to Commander O'Neill? He's dead. Why are they putting him into the dirt? Come. Come, come. Sometimes we need to return to the place we think we have come from. Earth, even this new Earth, can be a place where, where life begins. And when life ends, it can be a place to rest. Are we all gonna go in litter, Yale? No, no. <laughs> Not for a very long time. But we have to be very careful. We are in a new place now. Everything is different. Commander O'Neill died because he forgot that. That even a little animal, as cute as can be, can be deadly here. You understand? Okay. Now, I expect that if either of you see anything like this, you will stay far, far away. I will. I promise. You heard me too. Far, far away. We dropped our communication dish here. Cargo was due to land here, but the other 15 pods could be anywhere. Sweetheart, give me a number nine antiseptic. So you know, I am equipped with a variety of scepters and retractors. Not interested. Here you go, Dad. Uh, no, number nine, okay? Well, that settles it then. I think uh, once we get the vehicles operational, we should head out. Mm -hmm. We wanted to be pioneers, Yale, and we've come this far. Dad? We're not going to be able to go home, are we? Excuse me. No, we just can't. Excuse do it. me. Yeah. Am I hearing this right? Are you planning a trip or something? We're charting our way to New Pacifica, where we dropped our communications dish. Give me a minute with your boss here, will you? It's okay, I'm a good guy. You're crazier than I'd heard. Yeah. You can't just drag this group across whatever the hell landmass this is. Half of us weren't even supposed to set foot on this planet. And I'm sorry for that. But we didn't come this far to stop now. Shockadare? We have crashed onto this planet. We have lost most of our cargo. I just saw a man get killed by a rodent, for crying out loud. Maybe you haven't noticed it, but your plans have changed. New Pacific is not the priority anymore. Certainly is a priority for 248 families on our colony ship. 26 months from now, they'll be here. And I've promised them a fully operational outpost. That's your mission, lady. That's your mission. Half of us are hired hands here. You read the risk disclosure when you took this job, and you were paid four times the standard cryosleep rate. And don't you dare invoke Broderick O'Neill's death here. The man was my friend. It's not about contracts or friendship. It is about survival. You want to move on? I say you put it to a vote. Thanks for your advice, Mr. Danziger. What I really need right now is a trans rover that's operational. Think you can handle that? Oh, my God. On the ridge. Oh, Lock, secure. Voice print, my order. Stay in there. Don't open it.
What is it? Some sort of biped creatures. Zero, are you there? No indication of alien bipeds. Still no indication. But they were just there, Zero. I am scanning movement over the ridge. I am picking up movement over the ridge. I'm picking, picking up, up two meters, meters per, per second, second approach. Two, two beings. beings. Scanning at 1,700 meters. Two biped creatures. What, what is it? I have them in range now. They are on approach. Visual feed. They are alive. Boy, that was bedlam, wasn't it? Now, when that ship started going down, us in the clutches of gravity like that, my first thought was, you know, we're gonna be dead. Oh, real food. Mm. You don't know the sick feeling I had. Morgan and me waiting, and the windshield just lopping us right off. Oh, yeah, and, and the thought that we would never see any of you again. And if somebody had been trying to get in, when that auto airlock snapped shut, boy, that just would have been, that, that was just, that, that was hell. Does anyone want to talk about what we saw today? Thought we all agreed they were animals. Animals don't carry staffs. None that we know of. Maybe it was an illusion. Tips of the rocks. What about the light? Sun flares is just not a good enough explanation. Let's not make any assumptions. There's a lot we don't know about this place. Find time to realize that. too dangerous. What do you want? What was that? Who said this? What, 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 what is this place? Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. What are you? Leave me. I don't have dreams. 
can't stay with us anymore. Those things that killed the commander? Just just go back to camp. You're not supposed to be out here. Yeah? Neither are you. And those things are evil. Yale told us to stay away from them. She's not evil. You're evil. It's your fault you got sick, and we had to come here in the first place. You're gonna get us all killed by those things. And I get a tell. No, you're not. Hey, let go of me. Shut up. It is your fault. Let go. No, just stop. Stop. Let go of me. Where are you? Come on, Yuli. Yuli, answer me. Yuli! Zero, how much further? I have a gear reading at approximately one half meter. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I got him. Yeah, this is him. I think I see him. Yeah, I got him. I got him. Um, 
Kevin. Going about this wrong, that's all. There's got to be a way. All right. We need everyone out of here. I'll stay here with Zero, but that's it. Everybody else goes back to camp. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, we'll find your kid. Just leave me some supplies. I know how to respirate. I'm not leaving until we find him. Okay. We'll keep in contact over gear. If you lose us, if you hear anything at all happen to us, I want you to pull up stakes and get the hell away from here as fast as possible. You understand me? All right, let's go. something here. 63 meters exactly. Sensors indicate a large labyrinth-like system. Will a man fit down there? Yes, but as a zero unit, I come with a variety of excavation accessories. Of course, they were all stolen. I'll have you on gear the whole time. Let you know everything I see. Val, you hear me start screaming in terror? You take that as your cue to yank me out of here. Without fail, sir. Track me down here? Sir, I have excellent tracking capabilities. How's it going there, little girl? I'm fixing a trans rover. Anything I can do to help? My name's Bess. We haven't met yet. What's your name? True. And, uh, there's nothing you can do to help. It's not your fault, True. We're gonna find you, Lee. We're on this together. Morgan. Well, what are y'all waiting for? Can they kill us too? What is he doing? Morgan, just be careful, okay? Just put it down. Wait a minute. Morgan. Morgan.
Well, there you go. Show these things who's boss on this planet. You idiot! Hey, where you going? Underground river or an abandoned mine. Any sign, footprints, signs of struggle? Nothing. Like it's been empty forever. Julia! Julia! It's it's Alonzo. He keeps calling for you. Alonzo? You all right? They're Tarians. What? They're Tarians? What did you say? The creatures. The ones who swim up from the Earth. Alonzo, are you with me? How do you know what they're called? Because I talked to them. I talked to them. Some rest. I'll stay. Twenty-two light years for this. I haven't given up hope yet. And I know you haven't either. You'll find him. What was I thinking, Yale? Why did I bring all these people here? You did not bring them, Devon. They followed you. 250 families still out in space will tell you that in person when they reach this planet. I don't know. Maybe we had no right, Yale. Maybe we're not supposed to go to the end of the universe to save ourselves. Maybe we just haven't gotten there yet. Devin? Are you there? I'm on. What is it? I think we have a way. What are you talking about? Yuli, I think we know who or what has him. I think we might be able to reach him. I'm not saying I'm sure it's going to work, but I think it makes the most sense. The soil on the ridge was disrupted just like it is over here. I think they're trying to approach us through Alonzo's dreams. And you think they're going to try and reach us again? I don't know for sure, but all we can do is put Alonzo to sleep and try. Hey. All I said is I saw them in a dream. Yuli was not taken in a dream. Guys, you up there? But what is it? I think I'm into something here. Whatever lives down here, I don't think it's animals. OK, so what are we going to do? I'm going after him. I'll take the sedative. I'm not just sitting and waiting. I don't have any other choice. Devon. No, Rem. Alonzo, this isn't right. They approached you. You have to go with her.
here, Devin. I'm here. What have you done with him? I assume you know the risks a child like Ulysses faces going into cold sleep. I'm aware of the risks, but we don't have much choice now, do we? I love you, Mom. They fear us. They're confused by us. Why? Why are they doing this? They're aware Yuli is special. Different. The abduction is an attempt to understand us through him. This dream plane is real. It is the only way they can reach us. claim we've been here before, to this planet. What? What are they talking about? We've never been here before, never. They fear we're evil. We left our mark on the planet already. No, we came here for life, for a chance to live. No, we, we came here. Return is not a gift. It would have a price. What, what, what is it? Tell us what it is. Devin. Anything. Devin is not our fight. I don't care. I will do anything. I will give you my life for my sons, please. Devin, it is different for them. What are they doing?
you feeling? You all right? What happened? I don't know. Where are you going? Devon? If we can average 20 kilometers a day, we can make it to New Pacifica in nine months, or at least what we used to think of as months. And we will still have 17 months to prepare for our colonists. It won't be easy, and I don't understand this new world better than any of you. But I know New Pacifica is here, and I know somehow we'll be all right there. I think we've all seen something here that could help us believe that. So that's it. You think we should just take off? Just like that? No. I think we should take a vote. to this planet, a group of strangers. And now we head out, still strangers, but united toward a single purpose, braving this new land. Four days ago, aliens landed on a distant planet, and we are them. Now we struggle across an unknown planet, an uncharted world, looking all the while for that moment when we must fulfill our promise and wondering what will stand in our way. Devin, I don't know what kind of promise we made, what kind of price we're gonna have to pay. I don't either. I know I'd make it again. 